Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good evening, everyone. I'm Meg McLeod. Here's a quick look at some of our stories tonight. Thousands of women will have to find a new OBGYN. Women's OBGYN in Saginaw announced its closing after 74 years. They'll continue to schedule surgeries through September 27th, and they'll see any postpartum and gynecological patients until mid-October. They plan to take emergency calls until the end of October. They say they can transfer your medical records to another doctor as long as you fill out a form by the 20th. Temperatures are starting to cool and soon we'll be turning on the heat. And now is the time to apply for the home heating tax credit. You must meet certain requirements to qualify. You'll find those by clicking on this story on WNEM.com. People across mid-Michigan are remembering the lives lost on 9-11. Today, many visited a memorial in front of the Frankenmuth Fire Station to learn more about those from Michigan who lost their lives during the terror attack. The memorial even has a piece of steel from one of the towers. Back in uh, 2010, uh, two of our firefighters volunteered to go to the Fishkill Island in New York. And uh, we, we had to arrange to uh, select a piece of steel. We gave them dimensions and we got don donations from the community and, and businesses to establish our own memorial in front of our fire station. He says since the attack, there haven't been enough young people volunteering to be a first responder. And now here's Chris with your first alert forecast. Meg, some areas who may have needed a little bit of rain got lucky to see some raindrops tonight. However, it doesn't look like there were many. The radar still battling some dry air near ground level. So while we have seen some rain hit the ground, it really hasn't been much, and those showers should come to an end here pretty soon. We take a look at your sky tracker. We've got cloud cover starting to move out. Clear skies taking over later tonight. Now those clear skies may be a bit hazy, and that could continue tomorrow as we still expect some wildfire smoke. But generally speaking, Thursday, not a bad day overall. And the best part about that smoke is that it's going to stay high above our heads. We're not really concerned about that having an impact on our air quality. That should be the case as we work through the next couple of days. So we're not too worried about that. Low temperatures tonight will be in the 50s tomorrow, expecting temperatures to be in the 80s. Once again, we have dialed back our highs just a little bit because of the smoke factor, but we still expect uh, tomorrow to be a pretty warm day. Your seven day shows the 80s continue into the weekend. We'll get some spill off clouds from Francine, but the rain is expected to stay to our south as we head into next week. The 80s stick around through at least Wednesday. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24-7 for the latest news, weather, and information.